much success. I appreciate everything you're doing. But y'all take all the jobs, man. You guys make it hard out here for a brother. Well, I will say that I recently gave up one of those jobs. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, like I, I like, you know, I, I had to do a Kaepernick and take a knee from radio for a minute. But, um, you know, between point A and point B, I may make a return at some point or another. And I'm like, you know, like soiling my other creative oats, okay. which, you know, I always love the seasons when you get to create and do different things. Like, you know, like, like last year I was training to fight, you know what I mean? Yeah. And then, you know, and that was fun and within itself too. And then, you know, so like now this allows me to put more time into music and stuff like that and working on like acting and also, you know, hitting uh, the, the comedy circuit as well. I actually, I, I read about you leaving the radio show. Wasn't that your show? Like you created the show. Radio is a very interesting thing. You know what yeah. I'm saying? I you did have radio a lot of... for 15 years. I, I hear you. Okay, so you know about the politics that go on behind the scenes and, you know, the secret hands that move certain things. And then it, it gets to a point where you have to be like, you know, well, wait a daggone minute. You know what I mean? And decide whether or not you want to, like, you know, come and torch the place or just be like, you know, tip your hat and walk out, you know, slowly and, you know, and still have a good uh, good public standing. And I did the latter. I'm like, st I'm like on week two of not doing radio. So, like, rolling over at 6 a.m. is like the equivalent to me of like waking up at 8 a.m. You know what I mean? Like yeah. not getting up at four is amazing. Like I get up, <laughs> I work out, I get to make sure my kids clothes match, you know, when they go to school, as opposed to like, you know, they coming home and I'll be like, yo, you let them go out in that? So <laughs> to be there for all those cool little moments that I've missed out on all these years, because I've been doing morning radio for like, oh my goodness, yeah. almost 18 years. So there's a lot of things I didn't have the opportunity to participate in and be a part of. So it's de it definitely feels weird and unique. And I know it's just temporary because, like, I mean, I'm already getting other offers and I'm just trying to just not rush back into something because yeah. I really want the, the next thing I do has to be something that's like really true to my purpose and true to my brand.